Virgo, hello, hello, hello. Happy Saturday. If you have not already done so, please remember to like, subscribe, and share, and make sure you hit the bell button. If you're new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. My name is Nikki. Thank you so much. Virgos, things to look out for in April. What should Virgos look out for in April, Spirit? Take what you need and leave the rest. Choices. What should Virgo look out for in April? Maybe there's some sort of overwhelming situations that's going to take place in your life. It's going to be, I'm hearing, daunting for you, okay? Uh, worrisome. You worry enough as it is, okay, Virgos? What to look forward to? What to watch out for in April? Got the hair off him. Hold on, these cards are jumping. Maybe somebody's in trouble with the law that you know. They're probably asking you, can you bail me out of jail? You shouldn't have got your ass in there in the first place, okay? They're hung up somewhere, okay? They're hung up. And they want you to get them, help them, help get them out of trouble, okay? Um, you're worried about somebody probably having to call around, ask for money to, to get this person out of jail, to pay the bail or whatever the situation that comes about. Let's clarify. Seven of Cups for Virgo. Let's clarify the, this Seven of Cups, please, for Virgo. This is some sort of energy. We got the Knight of Wands and we got, they're creating a burden in your life here. Okay. Uh, like a, I'm hearing a sticky situation. They're very, very fast. <laughs> you know, they want to rush and you don't want to rush. This could also be a connection, a relationship. Let's just take this leap of faith. Let's get, let's just get married. Let's just shack up, move in together or whatever. They want to rush, but you want to slow down and pr proceed with caution and take your time. Okay. But somebody wants to rush into something and that's not always a good idea. All right. We got the sign card. This person is very, very fast moving. All right. And we have Ten of Cups. They, they, they move so fast that they don't realize when something may not be good for them. And we got the tower. And we have the lover. So this could be somebody you know. It could be a grown child or anybody that you know. They rushed into a relationship with somebody thinking that everything was going to be okay. Maybe they they had a disagreement or something with um, a re the relationship, some sort of argument or fight. The police were calling this person ended up in jail and they want you to help bail them out. Okay. And you're up at, at night worried about this person as it is this emperor because they're a risk, a risk taker. And they do a lot of things that they shouldn't do. Rushing so fast at something and not really seeing what's, what's in front of them. All right. Things to watch out for in April 2022 for Virgos. Clarify this emperor's energy right now, please, in April. Okay. And we have the lovers. So definitely dealing with a lover. Okay. Maybe they, like I said, they got into it about something. Maybe somebody ended up in jail. Somebody was hot headed. You had this emperor here who was, who was hot headed and maybe did something, maybe slapped her across her face or some threw her across the floor, whatever. Okay. And they messaged you. I'm in jail. Can you help get me out? Okay. I don't have no damn money. <laughs> I don't have any money. I'm not wealthy. I'm not Rockefeller. I'm not Oprah Winfrey. So you have to stick this one out. I told you leave that bitch alone in the first place. All right. courtship okay somebody was poss possibly cheating as well toil and labor maybe somebody was messing around with somebody at work maybe this person was messing around with somebody at work thief see we got adjudication here okay i going to court to figure out what's wrong and, and getting in trouble i'm gonna clarify the thief part you could have a thief at work too child 
and we have concern, somebody's concerned about how they're going to get their child out of jail or how they're going to get their child out of trouble. Dealing with this person, you told them to leave a long, away, you told this person to leave this person alone, to leave this person alone a long time ago, but they didn't. And now they locked up, okay? Calling you for help. And two, it could be anything. It doesn't have to be around a relationship. You told your child, I don't care how old they are, not to do this, not to do that. They won't listen. They're going to end up in jail, juvenile. They're going to call you. Miss so and so is so and so your child or your teenager. Well, they got arrested for or whatever, you know. Okay, I'm hearing some of them, very few, will get arrested for a controlled substance. That's what I'm hearing. Things to look out for in April for the earthly Virgos. Things to look out for in April. Seven of Pentacles, setting some goals and being patient with yourself and your manifestations. Yeah, because this is some goal setting. You're probably wanting to do something different financially here. This is you evolving, saying, I want to do this. I want to save money. And I'm not talking about a little money. You want to save a lot of money, possibly like $10,000 or more to move, to physically move to a different location or to save to buy a house. Okay. What is Virgo manifesting here starting in, in April 2022? Oh, we got the tower. Okay, so why is this tower card here for you? Stop letting what goes on in your life hinder your progress forward. You have a habit of starting something. Maybe, maybe you're wanting to save. You have started to save, but you dig into that money because you have other things coming your way or other opportunities that present themselves and then you fall off the bandwagon to movement forward okay you've learned a lot you you can evolve and move on and manifest whatever you want in your life but sometimes you got to move away in order to do it Virgo. sometimes you say you got i got to pack up and go you know because as long as you stay where you are you're never ever going to save what you want or what you need to, you're going to keep on having these tower moments that's going to come into your life that's going to keep setting you back. And sometimes that's okay because sometimes that may be spirit saying, well, I'm not ready to release you from this energy yet. But sometimes you got to know when to let it go. Okay. And that's what your intuition is all about. Learning more of your intuition, how to follow your intuition. You have to be the one. I see one, one, one. Okay. You have to be the one, Virgo, who can who can say, well, you know what? I've learned from past mistakes, from what I've been through before. I know when it's time for me to let this go. Yep, you have. You've learned a lot because you have been hurt in certain areas of your life and wounded. And, and you have been put you have put yourself on the defense of so many times, but you've been resilient. Okay, and now, and you've been paranoid because you say, well, I don't want to, I don't want to fail. I don't want person, people hurting me anymore. So some of you are wanting to do something totally different. Maybe you felt it in your mind and in your psyche that I need to move away completely. I just need a new venue, a new, just a new outlook on life. When I raise up my blinds in the morning, I want to see a different state. I want to see a different city. I want to see a different neighborhood or whatever. And I see you leaving. Moving on, um, doing something Virgo that you feel that you feel is best for you. But <clears throat> excuse me, but you have to save more. We have to. You have to save more. I say we. <laughs> so we have the Three of Cups and we have the Emperor followed by the Page of Cups. OK, this could be some this could be some family issues too. maybe celebrating something or wanting to plan a party or some sort of gathering. But you got people who really aren't giving as much as they should, possibly because they can't afford to. OK, you feel that they're not doing their fair share. Maybe they feel that you aren't doing your fair share. So there's some I'm hearing conglomerate <laughs> or some sort of um, some sort of cat. What is it? I can't even say the word um, collaboration collabing with somebody but it's not turning out the way you would want to or the way you hoped it would turn out because somebody's not giving as much as they should and they could they just choose not to and they want you to do all the work virgo okay <clears throat> what to look out for virgo in uh april of 2022 
what to look out for for Virgo, April 2022. Just make sure I got these right so they won't be all out of whack. All right. What to look forward to, Virgo, in 2022. April 2022. Got the tower and we got the lovers. Wow. Somebody's walking away from heartache and pain. It's like flat out, I'm done, but you get the fuck out of my life. I'm done, okay? Because you were a player, okay? This person was a player or you just decided that you're manifesting this person out of your life because it's not working out. Let's clarify the tower moment. What happened? What will happen to make you to make you leave this person alone? Because they broke your heart. And two, some of you, this could have been last April. They treated you unfairly. You gave too much in this connection. And you probably couldn't trust this person anyway because of their, their toxic ways, uh, because of their controlling ways. But your intuition told you that this wasn't the person for you anyway. But it took a wake-up call with them fucking around on you in order for you to see it. See? That you found out that they were fucking somebody else. And that just did it for you. You couldn't do it anymore, so you walked away or you will walk away. Okay. Because you're not taking that until the rest of the year. You're walking away. Because you know that you deserve because you know that you deserve better. We have the Empress. You have opportunities with financial stability coming your way too. More money for you to save. Some of y'all need to save more than ten thousand dollars, and I don't know why I'm saying that. Maybe you know why you need to save more. It could be for a car, car. It could be a down payment for a house, or it could be to relocate to a different state. All right. But you realize that you don't want this negativity to follow you in your past. So you're leaving this issue behind. You're leaving this person behind and you're saying, you know what? I deserve to be happy. We got the king of cups and a queen of wands. So you could be meeting a lot of different people, maybe setting yourself up to date other people until you realize, okay, now this is somebody I can really dig. This is somebody I can really click with. All right. The empress, the king of pentacles and the queen of cups. This is you emperor or empress here. Looking at your money and realizing, I know I need more. I know I need to save more. Okay. Definitely thinking about saving because it's going to help you move on. Okay. And and do some different things in your life. But because you're tired of holding on and you're tired of being in the same place, the same boring ass place over and over and over again. Like I'm done. I'm so I'm sick of it. I'm bored. I'm ready to move forward in my life. I'm ready to do something different. I'm ready to start a new life. See, Will of Fortune. Ready to start a new life, Virgo. Ready to start a new life. So that's what to look forward to and um, things to watch out for in April 2022. All right. Talk to you later.